this camp I'm in Vegas I train at syndicate I'm trained with John Wood he helps me a lot we do missing parts we do jiu-jitsu grappling and uh, freestyle wrestling here how we ended up with Armand is kind of a, you know, it's an interesting situation. I'm very close with his manager, Daniel Rubenstein. Danny is very familiar with the kind of style and the kind of person that will fit well here. He brought Armand in. We started working and clicked, you know, we started clicking with the team. And then obviously the situation with Gamrot came up where they're both currently training in and out of ATT. So long story short, it kind of made sense after that fight was booked for him to stay here. Got a good team going. I stayed in Las Vegas because I got a good team. Jorge Capatillo, he's my boxer coach. He helped me a lot too. I'm improving my boxing with him. I like training with him because he's smart, not just hard training. Arman is very special because he got a very, very good work ethic. He's very disciplined. He's a quick learner. And it makes me happy to have a fighter that is disciplined and ready to work. Wow! Oh, Sarukian backs him up. This is it. Armand Sarukian! I saw the fight with Armand and, and Gamrod coming long ago. These are two guys that are just much better than their rankings. Uh, a lot of people ranked ahead of them do not want to fight them. And I did everything I could to avoid it. I actually reached out to the UFC months and months ago to say, hey, look, I see where this is going. Let's keep these guys separate. They're both top five guys, they're both championship level guys. Eventually they may have to fight, but let's not do it until they absolutely have to. My goal is to be a UFC champion, and uh, for me it doesn't matter if UFC offered me to fight with teammates. To get the title shot, I'm gonna fight.